Before this video starts, if this guide helps you out in any way, shape, or form, like and subscribe. Also, comment down below if you have any questions. Let's begin. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to show you guys exactly how you could go ahead and make shirts inside a Chromebook. So let's go ahead and get into it right now. Yes, guys, you can make Roblox shirts, pants, whatever you want inside a Chromebook. So let's go ahead and begin right now. So first, guys, what you want to do is go ahead and go into Chrome. And then go here. And then, guys, type up custom mousse. And then, guys, go on it right here. And from here, guys, what you want to do is go ahead and go over and click Get Started for Free. And from here, you guys could start designing Roblox shirts. So, find one you guys want to kind of replicate, click Remix. And now we have to make an account. So I'm going to continue with Google. Let me quickly make an account with these guys. Continue. There you go. So I just made an account. Continue. And yes, guys, you do need to make an account with them unfortunately but you, i made it. it takes like two seconds you could sign up with google now we could click remix and we can start designing this so i'm just click accept it's gonna take some time to obviously load the assets for example this is gonna take some time it says model loading and uh let me quickly refresh. Okay, so it's pretty much loading. And now, once it loads, what we wanna do is customize it. So let's say you want this chain. You click on this. Okay, and we could put on this chain. We could color this chain however we wish. Now I'm gonna go for blue. And as you can see, it looks pretty good. So we can now customize other parts of this shirt as well. So we could go ahead and customize the fabric. For example, let's make the fabric blue as well. There we go. So the image. We could delete this. And let's say if you want as well. You could add accessories to this thing. Like a belt, for example. On the hand, I mean, like this. There you go. And then, you could add this, for example. Look at that. And we could change the color of this. So let's just change this. Uh, blue I would say we added some sleeves and already we have a quite a nice design now if we going to go ahead and sell this thing you could also use the AI by the way so you could do spider man let's see what this will do Okay, I, I spelled it wrong, so I don't know if this is going to do it. 
I don't know if this is gonna do it, but let's see how this AI turns out. Yeah, that's not good. Whatever. The AI needs some, you know, fixing, but it's all right. And there we go. So we have a pretty nice design here. I would say we've added some quite good media. We could add emojis to this as well, which is kind of cool. I don't know if you'd want to add this. If you want to add, you could add it. So we could put an emoji right in the middle. There you go. And behind this, we could add one more emoji right here. So on the back, because this side represents the back, we could add two emojis here. Nice. And now once we're done with everything, we click save. Then we click save and publish. And we wait. Now we click download shirt PNG. Now we downloaded the shirt. Now we want to go to roblox.com on our browser. Okay, not on the app, on the browser. Then we click on create. All right. Then go to creations. Okay, avatar items, and from here you click on upload assets, and you click on upload, where is it, so we select the shirt, confirm, and uploaded it, so now you could sell it and do all that, so from here, you could name it, you could add all the description to it, and all of the extra stuff as well. And you could put it on for sale now, just so you know. It does cost Robux to sell the shirt you made. And I've also just did a demonstration, obviously. This isn't the best shirt in the world. I'm not saying it's some world-class shirt you guys should copy in any means, because it's really not. It's kind of terrible, actually. So yeah, this was just an example. I obviously don't want you guys copying this as some sort of cool design because it's really not. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed and I hope this uh, tutorial helps. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.